Ghana is faced with some 12% youth unemployment and more than 50% underemployment despite major investments by both government and the private sector. With a recent survey conducted across the country revealing that only 10% of graduates finding jobs after first year of completing school, there is the need for the youth to be trained with basic technological tools that would help with skills capable of providing jobs for this unemployed class. To help address this, a consultative stakeholder workshop aimed at transforming the local economy and job creation was organized by the Ghana Tech Lab in Techiman in the Bono East region. We want to create a sustainable employment. So we call it a pathway to sustainable employment for social development or socioeconomic development. So in that regard, we have selected people, most especially unemployed people, uh, who will go through six months intensive training. We are giving them the basics, how they can handle camera, how they can produce short videos and images that can help them to start their own businesses and all that. Chief Executive Officer of Agrico Hub Mr. George Antribusiakun says the commitment exhibited by the participants is a sign that more of such engagements is needed in the area. For us, the, the contribution and the participation has been awesome. Uh, you could see the commitment and the enthusiasm of the, of the stakeholders who are the main participants, each expressing uh, their, their, their reception or their receptiveness of the digital media. They have expressed wonderful views, the commitment and the enthusiasm has been awesome and we are grateful to their, their coming. Abigail Tim Marfo is a graduate and one of the participants of the training. She says the skills obtained in the training would help reduce unemployment amongst graduates. Joining this program actually was just 15 days. I was not really expecting much, but a lot of my expectations were met. Um, I learned videography, how to edit videos with just with my mobile phone, so I don't need to purchase and um, video app and um, video editing softwares like Adobe Premiere and all that. I can just start with the basic mobile apps. So if these things are done freely, a lot of the youth will patronize and it will help them. They can start their own business. They can, and also for those who have already started, they can take it to the next level through the town means. So I think it will help reduce unemployment too. For Kojo Amwakun who joined the training from Atibubu, more needs to be done with regards to digital media trainings, adding that the move would help build businesses amongst the youth as well as decrease digital abuse. You know, uh, when young people are taught about technology, when the awareness of young people are created about technology and the media, you know, uh, digital media, it, it really uh, improves on their conscience. Uh, on using it for the betterment of their selves, their colleagues, and so on and so forth, other than abusing them. Aldu Sedu is a member of Agrimol Ghana. For him, such trainings would create more opportunities for starters. I think some of this, uh, this program, Agrimol Agrico Hub is doing, I really commend that it should continue because in a larger extent, it is going to create a lot of opportunities. Reporting for Joy News, Anas Sabit, Tichiman.